All right, now this wall, the east wall, this is my favorite display. So I like just to kind of sit here. These have a lot of displays that are gonna be permanent fixtures here. I use the, the rest of the room to just change things up seasonally, but I have a lot of displays that are near and dear to my heart. But I like just to kind of sit here and work on my stuff and you know, watch the centerpiece of the room, which is right here on this east wall. But I got Bret Hart display. I got Demolition display. Samoan Dynasty. I got my Stone Cold Steve Austin display. I mean, these are displays that I'm pretty much gonna keep as is for the duration of, you know, however long I have this wrestling room. But I have quite a few of my Bret Hart related figures right here on this side. Actually, I need to change this Shawn Michaels because the Shawn Michaels display used to be right here, but I switched spots with it. But got my broken skull belt right there, along with my Steve Austin pieces. I actually have two Steve Austin displays. I have another little mini one right here. This display right here in the middle, what I was trying to do was do a less is more type of a theme. You know, I was able to, you know, something that doesn't need a bunch of figures to make it look good. And it's, it gets difficult, especially when you start to acquire so many darn figures. Like that's my second Undertaker display. It looks good there, nice and simple. You know, this Ric Flair display used to have, you know, less than it is. It's starting to get packed in there, but it's still like a less is more type of a deal. A CM Punk display, I just recently put that up. I just acquired the CM Punk Supreme. I'm a real big Roman guy. I know people are hating on Roman because of whatever, you know, but you know, you can't deny his spot in history. I've got these, the big Hasbros this year at my local toy shop. They had uh, some acquired somebody's collection. I love the TV right here. That's just a great centerpiece. You can watch all the wrestling at once in this wrestling themed room. This I've had up since last year. My winged eagle display. These are all the men that won the winged eagle. There was 14 men to win it. And these are all 14 of them that won it. The only thing I changed out was I changed out a basic Undertaker for, that's a little bit more appropriate at the time period that he actually won the title. I think that's a debut Undertaker. But still, it's closer than the one that I had. The basic that I had was about the mid nineties era. Now this one got so big that I ended up having to make a second spot for it. So now I have my second Road Warriors display. But this right here, I've tried to do everything Road Warriors. A, little, a lot of little Easter eggs. Got draws right there. Got Ahmed Johnson to whenever he tagged with them at WrestleMania 13. Paul Ellering, his Remco. Got the an older Paul Ellering from Mattel. But there was a big time period there. I was buying anything and everything. Legion of Doom or Road Warriors. I bought a ton extra of their helmets, their shoulder pads. I was able to acquire a complete set of the Legion of Doom 2000. Got a great deal on those LOD Mattels and some of that was getting rid of their, actually that was the, it was the black ones, the Road Warriors, that somebody was getting rid of their collection and gave me one heck of a deal. I got them for about, I have another video on that, but it was less than $60 for the two of them. It was just an unbelievable deal. He was just wanting to get the heck rid of them, get back what he put into them and make a little extra because he got them at retail because he was a long time a collector. It's my whole Kogan display. Now, whenever they were doing the Masters of the Universe, I was really big on collecting those and they didn't, it was hard to find that Hogan one with the Snake Mountain ring, but I was at a recent toy show where the guy had them, had them for a decent price too. I was gonna say it was like about 60 bucks or so. my Shawn Michaels display. I got this picture of Shawn from a Texas All-Star Wrestling Independent show. And I don't know if he was working for their company at the time, but I have not seen that picture on the internet. As far as I know, I could be wrong, but that's one of like the few pictures of him at that age working at an independent company that I haven't seen replicated anyplace else. This is my Outsiders display. Anything Hall and Nash. day shots of X-Pac. And then this is my Ultimate Warrior display. This is why I don't like to display stuff on the bottom. That's why the majority of my displays I'll put like 
inbox figures at the bottom because the it's just hard to it really doesn't do them justice when you have them on that bottom shelf they kind of get lost in the shuffle and i got that middle display i came to find that i had a bunch of referee figures so many so that i was like well, i probably make my own little referee display But anything Kane and Undertaker put here, I had a inbox defining moments that I actually got for Christmas around the time it was released. And I wasn't collecting big at the time, so I just kind of had him stored away. But once I got big into collecting, I found a good spot for him right here. And then, um, that's where I keep it on my miscellaneous heads, miscellaneous accessories, shirts. This is where I keep all, all the hands, have them all labeled. It was right at Survivor Series that I found this. I passed up on it on that on that Saturday afternoon. And then that same Saturday night, he came back. And I went back to that Walmart and I thought he was gone, but I had to do some digging. Somebody had picked him up and hit him somewhere, but I was able to get that LJN CM Punk. Bottom shelf, some miscellaneous. Some empty, this is an empty box. I have the actual figure on the uh, on the west wall. The wall, one for Lucy's, one here. A couple of wrestling books and games. And that's it, guys. That's, well, actually, not really. Got some more of my belts. Got a Roman Reigns cutout. That makes a great display piece. But these are all my belts. And that's the north wall.